y'all welcome back to another week's vlog i've actually been doing pretty good with these vlogs but anyways today is monday morning i'm on my way to class but if y'all reference back to my last vlog you know i said i was going to give this whole fitness journey another try god dang it man anyways so i have my gym bag here so after i leave class i have a few errands to run and then i'm going i was going to go walking at the park but it's gonna rain so i'm gonna just go to the gym um like my hat because they do period hey y'all oh it's a little bright out here where did i park anyways today's tuesday no today's wednesday i'm leaving class um i had one class but i was just talking to my friend for a while chopping it up so i have a paper that's due soon but i'm gonna actually try to turn it in tonight right now i'm trying to see if my friend tyra wants to link up so we can get something to eat and then i'm gonna go well i need to go to the bank i just got errands to run i'm going baby on baby anyways guys um and i'm going to ulta because like my skin like my face is i don't know how to explain it like i don't have acne but i have like little tiny bumps under the skin and it's really annoying and they've always been here and i don't know how to get rid of them because it's not like pimples it's just like little bumps and i just want my face to be clear so i haven't switched up my face wash in a really long time and i have like a skincare routine but i don't have a skincare routine if that makes sense yesterday in class of course instead of in class instead of paying attention i was looking up different face washes that are good to use and all that kinds of stuff well yeah and then i want to get just a few little makeup products or whatever and um stuff like that so so y'all I'm back from running my errands and back home y'all that sun is exhausting I think it was like 98 99 degrees outside today Whew, uh, like the heat really will tire you out you'll be exhausted for no reason anyways I wanted to show y'all what I got from Ulta and y'all know I worked there I just recently started working at Ulta so I got a little discount or whatever you know what I'm saying so I got some goodies. The first thing that I got is the CeraVe, CeraVe um, Renewing SA Cleanser. SA means salicylic acid, and this is supposed to clean and exfoliate, but it has no like exfoliating beads or anything in it. But it's supposed to be a good cleanser and to treat whatever is on my skin and help with the texture. Texture is, I guess, like the little bumps and I guess like any kind of just weird texture that might be on the skin. So I'm gonna try this out, I hope this works. When I was looking up information yesterday on my skin, it said a lot of the reasons for tiny bumps on the face could come from not exfoliating. So even though I'm cl cleaning my skin, I'm not exfoliating, meaning I'm not really getting all the buildup that's under my skin. So the Aveeno Positively Radiant Skin Brightening Daily Serum. The reason I got the skin brightening is because I do have a few dark spots and this is going to remove impurities for brighter, more even toned skin. And then also um, with skincare, I got two I'm sure everyone knows about this. It's like the new range or whatever, but I was a little skeptical to try these. I got two products from the Ordinary brand and I was a little skeptical because I hear great things, but then again, I also hear things like it breaks me out. It's too strong. My face fell off. Like I hear just all kinds of stuff, but I decided to try it. So first from the Ordinary, I got lactic acid and it has AHA and hyaluronic acid in it. And this is to help with the texture of my skin. Once again, the little bumps and all that stuff. And this is for nighttime only. Then also from the Ordinary, I got just some 100% um, plant-derived squalene, squalene, which is an oil. And this is supposed to be really good for hydration as well. Another good thing about The Ordinary and why they're like hyped up right now is because they're really affordable. Like this one was $5 and then this one was like $7. So it's good products, but it's really affordable. Because, you know what I'm saying, I'm broke. Next, Mario Badescu, Badesco facial spray and this is the cucumber aloe and green tea if my face feels a little dehydrated you can use this also as a makeup setter or before you put on your makeup anything like that speaking of makeup setting i also got the urban decay all nighter long lasting makeup setting spray i've always always wanted to try this so i got it and it's supposed to be up to 16 hour wear Ooh, not like i be really out here attending events and stuff but also from mario badescu badescu i got a random mario badescu mint lip balm also got which i've been wanting to try for a long time take the day off cleansing balm which i always want to try because i think it works i've never used it but i've watched tons of people use it and it just looks like it's literally going to me melt your makeup off even though i love micellar water which works which works great too but i just always wanted to try this so i got this in the little trial size 
for travel size or whatever. Next, I got NYX I Micro Eyebrow Pencil in the shade Espresso. My eyebrow pencils are running out and I wanted to try, I really wanted to try the Anastasia Micro Brow Pencil. It looks, literally, it looks just like this. But I was not going to pay like $30 or whatever for an eyebrow pencil when they all literally do the same thing. But, so I just got this one. And hopefully this works great too. It's just really, really tiny and fine, which is what I wanted to try. Then I got a NYX Matte Liquid Eyeliner because my F1 I ran out and I like the brush tip more than the felt tip. And I wanted to try the Revolution. It's like a new brand of makeup concealer and this is a color c12 i hope this is a good color but i use just la girl pro concealer and it works just fine for me um i have it on right now but i did want to try something else so got that i got two lip glosses first i got the ulta beauty brand they actually have a brand and this you can't really see it but it's a color it's called bear it's really nice it's like um tangerine or like a i don't know it's like orange pink almost but it's really light and it's just a shiny sheer lip gloss. This is cute. And then I just got a NYX Butter Gloss in the color Praline. And that's everything that I got from Ulta, guys. Hey guys, so today is Friday. And me and my mom are out and about looking for somewhere where I can have my graduation party. I graduate in December. And the places I wanted, they're already booked up for that day, so now we're across the bridge in Phoenix City, which is right across the bridge from Columbus, to see, because when my mom graduated from college back in the day, she had her graduation party at this hotel. So that's where we're at now. So hopefully they have something that'll work for me. A lot of the hotels in Columbus, they're not big enough, or you have to be out by 11. The party doesn't start until 11. Okay, well, anyway, so let's see. So, Ma, you had your graduation here when you graduated? I did, and I had a wonderful time. All of my family was here. We had the big cake table. We had the table for the presents. We had to decorate in cream and lavender. We had a nice time. We had a DJ, and uh, we had a special table set up for the family members and friends. It was pretty nice. We had a nice time. So, I want mine to be like that. Hey, y'all. It's way later. My cousin is in town. Not only is she in town, but she's moving here. Ah! Right now we are on fire. Right now we're getting ready to go out. So we're both in the mirror. We're gonna go to rest in peace. Rest in peace to the parking lot. Um, we're gonna go do trap karaoke. Never did it before, but it should be fun. I don't say a word. I don't say a word was on my grind and now I got what I deserve. Hold on, wait a minute. Y'all thought I was finished. When I bought that ass and money, I thought it was rented. <laughs> hey guys, um, so today is Wednesday. It's the middle of the week and I'm kind of stressed. I don't know. I'm just like annoyed, frustrated. I don't know. I just have a lot going on, like school, work. It's just a lot going on right now. But whatever. Right now, I just got home from my classes, and later at six o'clock, I have a NAACP interest meeting that I have to attend. And yeah, we're supposed to look, you know, business cat, you know, we're on the exec board, so they want us to look, you know, presentable. So I'm about to just kind of clean up my hair, find something to wear, and put on a little bit of makeup. But before I go, I wanted to start on this hair. I'm getting my hair done tomorrow. I'm getting a sew in. When I do wear a weave, I don't wear a weave that often, but when I do, I like for myself to look like as natural as possible. This is hair from Beauty Forever Hair, and I really shouldn't even be showing them because they're not paying me, but whatever. Maybe one day they will. I have four bundles of, this is, Brazilian curly hair and I have it in 222s and 224s so the hair itself is like my natural hair color is it's not like black but it's not light brown either so I'm thinking about dyeing this hair <coughs> oh this is how it looks oh I need to wash it but yeah, stretched out is 22 inches. And the color, I mean, to me, the color. And I'm going to have my hairstylist. She's going to sew it in and she's going to straighten it out. Once this curly hair gets straightened, it'll match my hair when it's straightened. So it won't be like silky straight, bone straight, but it'll be like a coarser look. So it'll blend better with my hair. Anyways, I really don't feel like dyeing this hair or my hair. 
because I just don't feel like it. And I don't know if I want to put this is the jet black semi permanent. It's like a rinse. I was going to put that on my hair and the weave. I just don't know if I want to put that in my hair because I'd be trying to keep my hair as healthy as possible. But I also want it to blend really well. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. I'm getting over a cold. But the girl who I'm going to, she's literally been doing my hair since I was a senior in high school. Now I'm a senior in college. So she's did like my whole, my whole family hair. So, <coughs> dang. So yeah. All right, guys, I am ready. I'm about to head out now. I am rushing, even though I live right down the street from campus and it's, I have like 27 minutes. But, I mean, if you're like a member or whatever on the exec board, you don't want to be late. You want to be early. That's not setting a good example. And I actually think I'm going to take these. I have been two earrings and it's not cute. But, uh, I ain't even got time. Forget it. I don't care. Accept me as I am. But I will see you guys probably when I get back. I know I'm super duper 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 late, but I am watching When They See Us on Netflix. I have been putting it off for months because this kind of stuff just really affects me and I just knew like I didn't want to watch it because I just didn't feel like, I don't know, I just knew how bad it was going to be and I just didn't want to put myself there. So I'm finally watching it. I'm on like episode, the part four. Um, they're talking about Corey Wise and his sister, well, no, his brother died. Oh, man. This is so sad. This is why I'd be, like, trying to tell, like, this is why I try to inform and I'd be going hard for black people. Black people have it so hard here in America. And people just act like it's not a big deal. We don't have the same opportunities, the advantages. We're not treated fair here, especially black men. <sighs> Anyways, I don't think y'all want to hear me ramble about when they see us because people have been talking about this and I'm just late. But I wanted to show y'all my hair from last night when I got it done. Um, it's pretty long. I don't have on no pants right now, so I'm not trying to. But it's pretty long. It comes all the way here to my stomach. And yeah, this was that curly hair. And she kind of blew it out a little bit. To be honest, she didn't really straighten it how I wanted it. Like, she sewed it in really good. But when I left her house last night, it was still extremely poofy. Like, she didn't really straighten it well. So, this morning, I just woke up kind of early and decided to um, go over it and straighten it some more myself. And, yeah, this is... Now it looks how I want it to look. So, yeah. So anyways, it's like 10 something right now. And I have to go to, uh, I think I already told you. I have to go to a mandatory meeting for my exit assessment. Y'all know I'm about to graduate. So I have to do this exit assessment thing before you exit college. So I have to go to a meeting for that at 1230. And then I have another meeting with my group project at 230. And then I have to go to work at 5. It's a lot going on. But um, I just thought I would show you guys how my hair turned out. I do like it. Um, so yes. And I usually always wear my weave like tucked behind my ears. It's just how I like to wear it. Gives it a more natural approach. Hey guys, sexy ladies. Just joking. 
it's Saturday morning. Well, it's not even Saturday morning anymore. It's like one o'clock. But um, I have to, well, me and my sister both have to work later on tonight. But when we get off work, we're going out with our cousins. We're going to go out tonight. I'm going out tonight. Anyways, so what we're going to do right now is try to go to somewhere to find something to wear because I don't be having like going out clothes. Like I don't go out that much to clubs at least. So I'm finding something now. Dang, can't even talk to these folks. Ah. Like I was saying before I was rudely interrupted. Like the places I be going is like chill, like you know. But we're actually going to a club tonight. So and I don't have anything to wear. So we're gonna come and go see if I can find something. But as for right now, oh Jesus. If y'all don't know, I've been super sick with the cold this week. I'm I feel myself getting over the cold. So I've been drinking this every single morning. The emergency to build my immune system before I go into the harsh environment. Hey guys, I'm watching some Raven Elise, but um, it is Monday, like 11.30, I have class at 12, I'm trying to hurry up, but I am, I have on workout clothes, because I'm gonna, once again, try this weight loss thing. Yeah guys, um, today when I leave class, I'm gonna go walk in at the park, just because I don't really feel like going to my gym. I don't know, I feel like walking outside, so well, I'm putting on my shoes, but yeah, so um, I'm going to go walking. I really do want an iced coffee. Do I have time? It's 11.34. Oh, I'll be pushing it. So yeah, but anyways, um, even though today is Monday, I'm going to be closing out this week's vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please, please subscribe to this channel if you enjoyed this video. I'm trying to reach a thousand subscribers by the new year. Help a sister out. Hit that subscribe button and be on the lookout for my next videos. And follow me on Instagram if you want to. Say.Sophie. I'll see you guys in my next one, huh?